I've been researching the way we present information in high stakes scenarios, and, and I found some things that were unfortunately kind of disturbing. Yeah. It, it seems like we've been optimizing for the dissemination of information as opposed to uh, its retention or its application. And this seems to have been the case for, throughout our evolution. The dissemination was, of information was a real problem. But we're still struggling with, with making that transition today. Uh, there was a general uh, uh, general mapis um, that had said basically that you know PowerPoint, these kinds of pa presentations that we give, give uh, are, are dangerous because they give the illusion of That's understanding. Right. Yeah, one of the things that, that I, I so I agree with the, with the sentiment very much. So one of the real challenges is that um, recent research on retention has shown that it's very counterintuitive. So in fact, uh, you, the, to the degree to which something seems simple and easily understood is inversely proportional to how well you later retain it. So if something seems completely in line with your expectations, if it makes sense in every way, then what your brain is doing is basically is basically signing off saying, this makes sense, this makes sense, I don't need to remember, I don't need to remember. There's nothing surprising. And if something is, is surprising, if it's challenging, if it's difficult, if it forces you to have the sense you're working at understanding it, that turns out to be much better for retention. So I see this as sort of one of the many examples where our, our intuitions about how we work uh, don't necessarily map on to what's the later, uh, later adaptive behavior. And so one of the hopes that those of us who do this sort of research is that as we teach people a little more, as we discover more, and we teach people a little more about how the brain works, we may be able to give people tools that allow them to overcome those intuitions.